Today we are going to talk about the clinical significance of nine regions of the abdomen. So you must have knowledge about the structures that are present in the nine regions of the abdomen because it will help you to know the source of the pain. If you don't know the structures that are present in the nine regions of the abdomen, so we have made a notes on it and we have uploaded this on our Instagram page and I have mentioned the link in description. You can check it out. So without wasting a time, let's get started. It's very important to know over here when you feel pain in the abdomen. So it may be happen just because of two reasons. The first one that is the inflammation and the another one that is the obstruction of conducting muscular tubes such as a bowel or you know the ureter as well. Now in the very first we have a right hypochondrium. So when you feel pain in this right hypochondrium it means it is coming from the gallbladder and the bile ducts. Now the another one that is the epigastric region. So when you feel pain in this epigastric region it means it is coming from the stomach and the duodenum. These two structures related from the epigastric region. Now the, let's take the another one that is pain in the left hypochondrium. So when you feel pain in the left hypochondrium it means it is coming from the pancreas. Now let's take the another one that is the right lumbar region. So when you feel pain in the right lumbar region it means it is coming from the right kidney. Now let's take the umbilical region. So when you feel pain in this umbilical region it means it is coming from the small intestine. Now let's take the another one that is the left lumbar region. So when you feel pain in the left lumbar region it means it is coming from the left kidney. Now let's take about the right iliac fossa. So pain in the right iliac fossa it comes from the vermiform appendix. Now let's take the another reason that is the hypogastrium. So if we talk about the pain in the hypogastrium it comes from the urinary bladder and the uterus as well. The last one that is the left iliac fossa region. So in this region we have a pain it comes from the sigmoid colon. So it is all about the clinical significance of the nine regions of the abdomen. I hope this video has given you a good understanding about the clinical of the nine regions of the abdomen. If you like this video so please share this video as much as possible to your needy friends. As always thanks for watching.